Welcome people to Real Stories UK. Police are still searching for a gang they believe stole five million pounds worth of Apple products during a hijacking on the M1. Officers said the lorry was targeted on a slip road in Northamptonshire. The driver and the security guard were both tied up, while the thieves drove their vehicle a short distance away before transferring the goods to their own truck and abandoning the pair. Northamptonshire police said they believe the gang moved all 48 pallets of Apple products to a third vehicle, about 10 miles away, before jumping back in the truck and driving off. Police are still appealing for witnesses to the incident, which took place between 7.45pm and 8pm on Tuesday the 10th of November 2020. Officers have been trying to speak to anyone who may have seen a number of vehicles on the slip road at Junction 18 between the state at times, which may have looked out of place or may have dash cam footage of the area, officers said on Tuesday. They would also like to speak to anyone who may have been offered any Apple products for sale in unusual circumstances or who knows of anyone who is selling such items at low cost prices. The hijacking took place on a motorway between Northampton and Rugby. The thieves drove the lorry with the tied up occupants eastwards to the village of Crick, about half a mile away. Police then said, after that, they made the short journey north over the border of Leicestershire and dumped the second vehicle in the town of Lutterworth. A police spokesman said, the stolen consignment included Apple watches, a variety of iPads, and charging devices. In June, the BBC reported that iPhones stolen during the looting in the US were tracked, disabled, and the local authorities were notified. The broadcaster reported that the devices displayed messages saying, please return to the Apple Walnut Street this device has been disabled and is being tracked. Local authorities will be alerted. The store was one that had been targeted by the looters. The firm has not responded to a request for comment and is not clear whether or not the devices stolen in the UK are being tracked in the same way or if any information has been provided to the local authorities. After thieves targeted two Apple stores in Perth, Australia, in September 2019, officers said the stolen phones had inbuilt security functions, which the manufacturer would enable, rendering the phones unusable. No one has yet been caught for this crime and the investigation is still ongoing. For the latest in urban news and stories, subscribe, hit that thumbs up, hit that notification bell and stay tuned into Real Stories UK.